A portion of this video is sponsored by LastPass. I'm Trent. I'm Haley. AKA Hailstorm. Oh God. And we are flying across the country in our plane to the world's biggest air show, Oshkosh, Wisconsin. Yeah. Our tiny plane. It's not that small. No. She's just terrified of flying. Little planes are sketch. Here we come. Here we come. All right, guys, the day has come. It is D-Day. Well, technically tomorrow is, but we're getting ready. We're heading off for Oshkosh early in the morning. We're just here getting everything packed and sorted to make sure everything's gonna fit. We got two weeks that we're going on that we need to make sure we can get everything in this plane. Done it twice before, but it's always been solo. Now I've got her coming. Oh. Haley, what is that? <laughs> what? That, really? What? This, this isn't, we don't have a checked baggage area. This is, that's not gonna fly. Okay, first thing, this is why we're doing this. That's gonna have to be repacked. No, what do you mean? I, I don't know what I'm gonna do now. <laughs> okay, so uh, obviously, I mean, we got pretty decent baggage space, but we're not bringing that bag. But the plan today, at least tonight, since we are leaving bright and early tomorrow morning, is to get everything sorted, make sure we're not forgetting anything get this thing locked and loaded because uh, we're going to Oshkosh. Oh, what is JP doing? He's over there editing. This is Oshkosh life from the start. Anyway, we got everything lined out. Aside from Haley's Giganta bag that's not coming, we've got everything here that we're gonna be putting in the plane. I'll run through it really quick with you so you know what we're bringing. So basically what we have is a first aid kit that's a really extensive one. We've got a small survival kit, which is actually pretty rad. Second chance survival sent that to me. Thank you, Levi. We've got my bag with all my clothes, my laptop in it. We've got a camera bag that's likely gonna get into a smaller bag. It's just, this is what I have. And we're kind of using it as a placeholder for Haley's Giganta bag. Uh, we've got the claw tie down system for tying the plane down. A tool kit that I always keep in the plane. We've got two fuel bags with a siphon hose. We have two lightweight camping chairs an extra quart of oil, some coolant, got the Declan uh, fuel additive, it's a lead scavenger. So this is good when you're running a lot of low lead in the Rotax, I like to run it. Uh, we've got some batteries for our headsets, and then lastly a little fish scale for us to weigh everything, make sure everything's uh, in weight and balance. Okay, first things first, let's get your, uh, your special things in that trash bag. <laughs> Thank you, Kitbox, for <laughs> making me my own booster seat. <laughs> Look at how thick that thing is from the I know. <laughs> you know, but seriously, I couldn't see uh, out of the plane at all. So um, I was just long for the ride. Mm. Okay, don't film that. <laughs> I just hit my face. <laughs> You're putting that in there, I know it. Look at that boost. All right, let's see it. How's it feel? Feel like you can see? Yeah, I mean. I will be able to. <laughs> I mean, it sits kind of tail low right now, yeah. but. Looks good. I mean, it's actually quite comfortable. What's our first leg, seven hours? <laughs> yep. I'm ready. Oh. How you feeling? Mm, my heart's beating fast. Um, I feel good. <laughs> it's just going to be a lot, but I'll be fine. I mean, It'll what, be perfect. What are you nervous about? No, I. this is a putt-putt. I, do, I don't like. Oh, stop calling it putt-putt. Well, it's a slow plane. Low and All right, so this is probably a pretty good time to remind you, if you haven't yet, you should probably subscribe. We're in for quite an adventure, especially with a very nervous flyer coming on an 16 or 1800 mile trip across the country in our little uh, small plane. So make sure to hit the subscribe button and, and hit the little bell icon as well so you get notified when I post so you don't go missing any of the action. You're, you're subscribed, right? No. <laughs> you're kidding. I. You don't subscribe, my own wife doesn't subscribe to my YouTube. I, I don't have a YouTube account. Haley, a Gmail account is a, is a, any Gmail account is a YouTube account. All you have to do is just log in. Well, okay, I don't remember my password. I'm sorry. You're serious. I'm dead serious. Well, that's a convenient time to talk about our sponsor for this video, LastPass. For those of you that don't know, last year on my way to Oshkosh, I actually had an email account hacked. And the unfortunate thing was that that password I used for that email account was the same password I kind of used for everything across the board, including like my bank account and a lot of other important stuff. And actually, Corey Robin was sitting across from me at lunch when this all went down. And he said, Trent, get LastPass. It'll fix all your problems. And that's exactly what I did. And for those that don't know, LastPass is an online password manager that allows you to store unlimited passwords for all your different accounts online 
but you have one master password. So it makes it really easy. No more forgetting passwords, no more getting locked out of accounts like YouTube. Everything's stored in one place. It also works on your computer, it works on your phone. It'll autofill, it's an awesome thing. And I'm saying this truly, I've been using it for over a year, or just about a year now. I love it. Go check out LastPass if you haven't yet. What? You've been using it for a year? Yeah. I, I have all my passwords saved to my phone in a note. Oh my God. Don't be her, don't put all your passwords in one note that someone can open and get all your accounts. Why didn't you tell me? Come on. <laughs> I didn't know you did that. Okay, she's gonna download LastPass. I anyway. am right now. Anyway, carrying it on. Thanks again to LastPass for sponsoring that part of the video. Now back to the regular content. All right, so really, weight isn't gonna be a concern with uh, how my, my nose weight is. I'm gonna take, I have some weights sitting on my tail. I'm gonna take those off for us cruising. So we have like 100 pounds of baggage allowance right now. We're well under that. I think we were at like 55. So uh, that's no concern. We're gonna be all set. We just need to repack your bag. Yep. And then uh, just kind of consolidate some things, but I think we're gonna be set. Yeah. Okay, honestly though, what, um, what are your concerns? What are you looking forward to? We know, okay, she's not showing it on camera, but she's really nervous. Well, I mean, it's just out of my comfort zone. I mean, yeah. I just, I'm, I'm a fair weather flyer and I don't like being out of my element and um, out of things that are not in my control. I don't know how to put that, but yeah. yeah. I'm a little nervous, but I mean, I'm excited. I'm excited to see what it's about. Last year I didn't make it. I'm excited to see the countryside and just hang with the boys and see what goes down. Yeah. And then there's always some action, so you're gonna experience some of that. Luckily, we got a 915 powered Kit Fox. Like we're cruising in style and plenty of power. Yeah. What what normally gets us is coming over the the Rockies or just east of Salt Lake when we get really high up into those mountains. And then through Wyoming, normally it's hot, and we're at you know 8,000 foot is like the elevation of runways we're landing at. So you end up in a really high density altitude. We're all packed to the brim, full on fuel. Getting out of places can be kind of scary, but turbo. I mean, I don't think we're going to have a problem with that. So that's good. Then we get into the whole rain and weather and thunderstorm side of things, which is always a little bit uh, dicey, but we're leaving so far in advance that we're not even going to push weather at all. Yeah. We're just taking our time. Yeah. So. We're just going to enjoy it. Yeah. So you're ready? I mean, as I'm ready as I'll ever be. <laughs> there you have it, guys. We are locked and loaded tomorrow morning, bright and early. We are gonna be out here and we are going for it. So, you guys know the drill. Like this video if you do. Subscribe if you haven't yet, seriously. Hit that subscribe button. Come be our wingman. And we'll see you guys on the next one. Peace.